Well, I know what movie's getting the most nominations this Oscar season. Alright guys, so Brooklyn. In John Crawley's Brooklyn, we follow the story of Irish immigrant Ailish Lacey as she travels to America. There, she sparks a romance with Emery Cohen's character and must ultimately decide if she wants to stay with him in Brooklyn or go back to her hometown in Ireland. Going into this movie, I didn't know what to expect. Before I saw it, I saw two reviews that like called it a masterpiece. However, I hadn't really seen any trailers or knew what the film was actually about for myself. So finally, I got a chance to see it with two of my buddies, and how was it? Well, let's find out. I'm not gonna even freak out in this review. Simply put, Brooklyn is a masterpiece, and it is currently in my top three films of 2015. From its acting to its score, everything about this movie is done masterfully. First, Sayorse Ronan, I'm sorry if I pronounced that incorrectly, but she gives a groundbreaking and realistic performance as this Irish immigrant. Not only is she able to pull it off as she actually is Irish, but she does a great job and you actually really root for her character and once she travels into America you can tell that she's like new, she's not really accustomed to some of the things that we had back in the 1950s that they didn't have in Ireland and also whenever she's like just experiencing something new for the first time you're hoping that she's gonna make the right decision and get out of the situation perfectly in every situation that comes to her you're also hoping that she gets out of perfectly and I also thought mentioning it's a bit ironic that She's traveling from Ireland to New York, but in real life, she was actually born in New York and she was raised in Ireland, so fun fact. All the side performances are phenomenal as well. All the other immigrants that she's living with do a fantastic job in this movie. They really like will play off each other really well. I like how the two older sisters are kind of teaching Ailish how to properly eat American food at her first date. I thought that that was actually pretty funny and a very good like overall scene of just like mentoring Ailish. I thought that was really well done. As well as my favorite side character in the film is definitely Emery Cohen. At first he kind of seems a little bit off-putting and you're like I don't know if he's I don't I don't know if he's the best choice for a man. But then as the movie goes on, this becomes one of the best romances of 2015. It's absolutely beautiful. You care about the characters so much and you hope that no matter what, they're going to stick together throughout the entire movie. The direction is also done extremely well here. Crowley's meticulous way of directing things makes it that every little nook and cranny in every shot is done to a T. From when she's actually in Ireland to when she's on the boat to when she actually arrives in Brooklyn, every single shot looks absolutely astonishing and certainly beautiful. The film also has a really great production design and great costume. Just from those two things alone, you know that, like, you you get this feeling that everything is set in the 50s and it works out so well because everything looks very, like, ant antique, kind of. I mean, I don't know if that's the right word to describe it, but everything, like, from the buildings, they look really good. And the costumes work perfectly for not only the girls, but also the guys. They look very realistic for the 50s time period. Overall, Brooklyn is up for consideration as my favorite film of the year at the moment. And overall, I'm going to obviously give it an A+. If I were to use a word to sum up this film, it'd be perfect. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. And until my next review, I'm Randomist for 401 and I will see you all later.